welcome friends in this video we will be talking about logical operators in c programming okay so first of all here we can see that logical operator so there are three first is logical and second is logical or and third one is logical not so logical and we will be writing m percent two times this is the symbol for logical or we will be writing or operator two times and this is the exclamation mark so this is logical not example here is this is binary type of operator so that we have two operands operand 1 operand 2 and the operator is in between this is also logical or and this is logical not in logical not we will be having only one operand with that now first of all we need to understand that logical operator works on which idea so it works on idea of zero and non-zero okay so you might have a question in your mind that what is this zero and non-zero so i will try to explain with one example if i'll write that in this particular case your operand will be either a zero or it is non-zero but in non-zero it is considered as one zero is considered as zero so it 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 means that it will only work on zero and one no it is not like that it is like true and false so zero is false one is true so we try to understand this idea of zero and one so if i write 10 so 10 means what non-zero and non-zero value is considered as one if i write minus 10 then it is again non-zero it is considered as one if i write 0 then it is by default it is 0 and it is considered as 0 so any value other than 0 is considered as non zero i repeat this is very important because in logical operator we will be working on any value but that value is to be converted into either 0 or non zero so what is this how we can convert or how we can formulate that so again i repeat any value which is not zero is considered as non zero and it is considered as one whether it is 10000 whether it is 5 whether it is minus 10 it can be minus 125 whatever any value which is not zero is considered as non zero and it is to be represented as one i hope you are clear so that now our operand in our operand in this case our operand will be either 0 or 1 means all the values which are 0 it is considered as re 0 or represented as 0 and all the value which are non zero are represented as 1 okay so based on that we try to understand or we need to see the truth table of our logical operator now logical end means what it is multiplication in other words it is not actually multiplication but in other words we can say that it is multiplication and logical or meaning is addition another meaning is very simple meaning is this is end okay we used to speak if you will work hard and you will attend the lecture regularly then you will get good marks so see here there are two things working hard and attending lectures regularly so when we are insisting that both the condition should be true or both the condition should be satisfied then we used to write and we are we are telling that dono sahi hona chahiye aapko lecture bhi attend karna hai aur aapko mehnat bhi karni hai you need to work hard as well as you need to attend the lectures regularly both should be satisfied to wahan pe kya use kiya humne aapne we have used and over there now in this case of or or means either you attend the lecture or you work hard so in this case we are giving freedom that any of one, these two one instruction should be correct okay so that we are using or either you go for uh, attending the lectures regularly or you work hard so dono mein se ek bhi sahi hoga to wo puri instruction ko sahi bolega aur isme kya ho gaya dono sahi hona chahiye so now true and false so here zero means what false and true one means true so if the first operand is false and second operand is false then the output of the logical end is false means what 
zero zero now logical end is multiplication so zero into zero is zero then logical or is summation so zero plus zero is zero means what if your both the conditions or both the operands are false then logical end return false logical or also returns false okay now if your first operand is zero means false second operand is true so logical end zero into one is zero it means dono condition sahi nahi hai ek false hai aur end mein kya hona chahiye dono condition sahi honi chahiye otherwise it is considered as false so here zero it is false one it is true but both are not true so that logical end returns zero but in the case of or zero plus one it is one it is see again i want to tell you it is not exactly multiplication and summation but just make you aware about it or to make it somewhat simpler we can say that it is multiplication and addition okay in this case 1 into 0 so 0 1 plus 0 is 1 in the last case if operand 1 and operand 2 both are true it is 1 it means both are true ye condition bhi sahi hai ye condition bhi sahi hai then 1 into 1 is 1 and 1 plus 1 here it is in binary so 1 plus 1 is 1 will not be considering at 1 plus 1 is 2 it is 1 okay so i hope this is clear so just to uh, remind you first of all in the case of logical operator everything will be converted either into zero or non zero zero is zero non zero is represented by 1 Okay, and then after we need to keep in mind this truth table that if both the operands are zero, then this multiplication is zero and addition is also zero. Now we take some of the examples so that it will be more clear. Okay, we'll be taking uh, some example. okay so uh by mistake i have written it module it is logical operator okay fine now in this case 10 and and 5 so now 10 is it zero or non zero it is non zero so it can be represented as one second operand is 5 it is zero or non zero so it is non zero so one and and one it means agar hum aapko le le and and ko le le multiplication so one into one is one so here answer should be what one so that you can see when you print this when you print this you will get one as an answer in this case it is zero so zero minus 5 all the values other than zero are considered as one so this is what zero and and 1 but it is 0 why because 0 into 1 is 0 here if the value is fractional if the value is fractional in this case also since this is non zero it can be represented as what 1 into 1 so it returns 1 see it is processed like this it is processed like this it is not like that ke a uh, value 12.34 will be converted into 1 no it is represented like this okay now in this case or so it is non zero means 1 non zero means 1 1 or 1 is 1 here it is minus 10 but minus 10 is also considered as 1 1 or 1 or 0 but this is addition operation so 1 plus 0 is 1 Zero in zero or or zero, so both are zero. So answer is zero. So this is logical or end and logical or. Now we talk on logical not. Logical not means what? It it inverts. It inverts the value or it reverses the value. The meaning of reverse means what? If you are giving zero, it will tell you. It will give you one. if you are giving 1 it will give you 0 we try to understand it is not 10 not 10 okay 
Now 10 is what? It is non-zero, so it can be represented like not 1. So not 1 means what? If it is not 1, then it is what? 0. And in this case, not 0. So if it is not 0, then what is that? That is 1. So if you are giving non-zero value, it returns you 0. If you are giving 0, then it returns you 1. So whatever you, whatever the value you are giving to logical not, it inverts or we can say it re reverse the value. If you are giving 0, it returns 1. If you are giving 1, it returns 0. So I hope all these cases you understood. If you have any doubt, you can write to me. Thank you.